true grammar. I know what you are thinking in that head of yours. Grammar? Yes, you say. I recall seeing it on television. Something of that sort. Um, actually, yes, you're right. Wow, he just read your mind, Apollo. Or everyone tells him that he made a good guess. Pythagoras, which was for us then? It was twenty years ago. A young magician, the genius of his time, came down among us. The fuck? His name was Magnifi Grammary. Was ist das denn für ein Bild? It was he who began the great troop Grammary. At his prime, not a day passed that he did not play upon the screens of every TV there was. I do have a vague memory of someone like that on TV. Yet, several day years ago, that time came to an end. My troop pulled a vanishing act, yes. Cries for magic no longer heard. The TV screen a barren waste, stripped of illusion. That's not true. I still went to all your shows. Like that one in the parking lot down at the supermarket. When you start playing in supermarket parking lots, you know you're in trouble. We hone our skills at these small venues, always awaiting our time. Yes, one day we will rise up from obscurity onto fame's shining stage once more. I do this not only for the magic that is Grammarie, but for my partner. Your partner? You mean... Yes, Zack Grammarie. Trucy's father. Before he disappeared seven years ago, there was no name higher than Grammarie in show business circles. None. I will see us return to glory, I valid Grammary. Our founder, Magnifi Grammary, was truly a genius, a worker of miracles. I'll never forget the one I saw when I was little. How he made that whole jumbo jet go, uh, what happened to the jet again? Apparently someone doesn't remember it as well as they thought. Of all the would-be magicians who came to his door, only that Zack and I had the talent. In no time at all, Valent and Zack were the shining stars in the Grammarie crown. Her <laughs> dad's at 9-11, ich hoffe nicht. Cool, huh? And Zack Grammarie was my daddy. Now that Magnifi and Zack are gone, I have but one wish. Let it be I, Valent Grammarie, who brings the Grammarie miracle back to the big stage. I'm rooting for you. Miss Trucy, you cannot grow up quick enough. I need your skill by my side. One skill coming up. How do we manage to get on the topic of the case so quickly all the time? Let's can express my shock and chagrin. All I can see before me is the stage and me upon it. Nothing smaller, nothing less radiant catches my eye. True, you're getting on in years. Not much time left to make your mark, huh? Mm, this is not how I was seeing it. So he doesn't care about what I have to show him. I get the point. Das heißt, egal was ich ihm zeige, er... Oh, doch, da sagt er was zu. I was wondering about the stunt in this video, right in the middle of the song. I didn't see a stunt. Oh, that. I guess I'm so used to seeing that happen, I didn't even notice. So young to be so jaded. A simple sort of... Oh, das hat mir aber jetzt schon. Wollen Sie magic for me? To you. That's why you were at this concert, und er wird es wahrscheinlich nicht verraten. Yeah, so, can you tell me how you did it? Oh, you can't just ask this sort of thing, Apollo. To see, it's against the rules to ask the magician how they did it. But when you're doing a murder case investigation, then it's not. Well, you might have a point there. What do you tell us, Uncle Pilot? It's against all that the secretary requires to how a trick is performed. Okay, so you tell me how he did it. So you tell me how he did it, Trucy. But I don't know. Come on, you're a magician. Aren't you part of the same secret club? Ich schätze, alles andere wird egal sein. Und hatte das sowas zu sagen? Auch nicht. Ah, the proof positive of your profession, yes. Uh, yeah. Might I have a look? Oh, what is this? It is gone. <laughs> what did you do with my attorney's badge? 
Don't be alarmed. Miss Trucy, take a look into your top if you want. Ugh, it's your badge, Apollo. What's it doing in there? That was amazing, wasn't it, Apollo? He called that pouch in her waist a top Is that some kind of magician speak? Pardon me. I have no money if that's what you want. Uh, no, no, I was just... Uh, never mind. The way he looked, the revolver. What was that? It was almost as if he had seen one before, and maybe he wasn't too happy about it. Hmm. Klingt ja so, als wäre hier sonst nichts mehr zu holen, indem wir ihm was zeigen. Was ist das wieder? Es ist ein bisschen doof, dass ich das jetzt nicht mal überspringen kann. Das hatte ich ja eigentlich schon. Hm, I wonder who left it sitting open like that. Das hatte sie aber, glaube ich, auch schon gesagt. That's the ladder we used to be. Okay, haben wir auch. Ich will, das jetzt auch nicht, nicht, ich will jetzt auch nichts verpassen, nur weil ich das nicht nochmal untersuche. Aber... I can't believe we were watching with the tools up on the tower. Yeah, I used to know like high places. No, I hate them. I do that. I nice if we found it, but it's closer to the ground. So that reminds me, Daddy's bad with hates too. Oh, I'm not kidding. Right here, right now, right now. And he puked everywhere into everybody's face. Poor guy. Electronics and the Fusania. Maybe we just fiddle with them. No fiddling. Okay, I think then gibt's ja auch nichts mehr. Aber vielleicht kommt es wieder was anderes irgendwo, dadurch, dass wir mit ihm gesprochen haben. Das ist halt auch alles durch. Emma jetzt mal hier? Ne, keine Emma da. Okay, das hier. We took a look at your performance again. It was even better the second time. Thank you. That reminds me, that was an incredible illusion you pulled off. Illusion? When you teleported from one stage to the other, remember? Ah. Yes, apparently they hired a professional magician. Well and Grammary. I was wondering, do you think you could tell us how it was done? I'm afraid I cannot. Mr. Grammary made me swear to never tell us so. I was afraid of that. Hard to be a magician if you can't keep a secret, you know. I, I am reminded that I wish to speak to you about something. Yes? When I was walking this hallway before, I stumbled upon a small device of some kind. It was lying on the floor. Device? Maybe you mean this? That's been lying there since the day before yesterday. Might I touch it? I thought as much. What? What do you think? This is one of our headsets. Everyone on staff wears one during a concert. I wonder who this is. We use it for communication. It would be quite inconvenient should it go missing. We'll hold on to it for you then. We'll give it to Prosecutor Gavin when we see him. Yes, that's best. Thank you. So can I put it on? <laughs> Receiver transmitter for voice signals. All concerts have wall one. Oh, Moment. Headset. <laughs> da stand gerade Headset attached to Trucy. Attached? I'm not some kind of robot, Apollo. Everyone on the staff was wearing one of these headsets. This might warrant some further inquiry. Sollte eigentlich einen Channel haben, der dazu gehört? Kommt doch nicht mit so komplizierten Sachen hier. Ten for that, little buddy. This is Trucy reporting in over. Why the sudden silence? No one answered. Don't be silly. What good is a receiver that doesn't receive? It's like Emma not performing forensic investigations. You make her sound like she's some kind of forensic investigation machine. Which is just silly. Unless she's a super high tech android that runs on snakus. Hmm. Maybe she is. Oh, 
Das habe ich glaube ich gerade vorhin schon gezeigt. Also, oh, Moment. Ja, ich sage ja Katzenklappe. Vielleicht können wir jetzt zum ähm, Detention Center. Okay, hier ist auch noch niemand. Wobei, wir haben ja eigentlich immer noch nichts, was wirklich äh, beweist. Can I ask you about this headset, Lamabor? You said that all concert staff were wearing one? That's correct. You need them to communicate across such a large stage. Everyone in the staff had one, of course. And all of the band members too, I should think. So Prosecutor Gavin and his lackeys had one on too, then. They're quite helpful, though limited. They only work within 30 feet or so. After all, they're only for use on stage. And a stronger signal would interfere with the sound system. Mm, that makes sense. You'd think someone would notice if they dropped their only communications lifeline. So why was this one lying here? Oh, jetzt haben wir aber neue Informationen. Das sieht nicht so 30 foot range stand da vorher noch nicht, glaube ich. Ich bin mir gerade tatsächlich nicht sicher, was ich übersehen habe. Vielleicht hm. gibt es auch noch irgendwas, was ich ihm zeigen kann. Ich meine, dieses, äh, egal was ich ihm zeige, doesn't care about what I have to show him, klingt ja so, als ob ich ihm nichts Wichtiges zeigen könnte, aber hat er hat ja zu ein paar Sachen jetzt doch schon was gesagt. Ich gebe einmal alles durch. Ich kann mir auch das äh, Headset jetzt nochmal... Freezy Panties haben wir doch gar nicht mehr. Oh, das habe ich mir schon gezeigt. Uh, vielleicht können wir das Headset jetzt noch mal Machi zeigen, nachdem wir die neue Informationen dazu bekommen haben. Auch wenn ich mir das irgendwie nicht vorstellen kann, dass das einen Unterschied macht. Das wird auch nichts bringen. Und ich glaube, die Lyrics hatte ich ihm schon gezeigt, ja. Das war eben definitiv alles gezeigt. Meine Marke hatte ich ihm ja vorhin schon gezeigt. <lacht> Kabellose Tastatur. <lacht> alle kabellosen Tastaturen, die ich bisher benutzt habe, waren immer irgendwie alle scheiße. Ich bleibe einfach bei Tastaturen mit Kabel. <lacht> Diese hier definitiv, ja. Ich dachte, es liegt nur daran, dass du besoffen bist, aber vielleicht liegt es auch an der Tastatur. Oh. Aha. 
Aha. Die Information, dass das so auch äh, mit den 30 Fees oder was das war. Okay, so besoffen bist du nicht. Gut, dann, das ist ja schön zu wissen. Ich habe immer gedacht, wenn hier diese ganzen Tippfehler bei dir kommen, wo andauernd irgendwelche Buchstaben fehlen, dass du schon so Hacke bist, dass du halt mit dem Kopf auf der Tastatur liegst oder so. Okay, die 30 Foot Range war offenbar wichtig. Oh nein, wer könnte das denn nur sein? Ich habe keine Ahnung. Oh oh. There's only one person I know who can munch with such venom. What are you doing here? Hello, Emma. You're looking as grumpy as ever. Oh, am I supposed to be happy? You give me the second degree in court and Prosecutor Gavin makes me look like a fool. You're talking about the bloodstain Mr. Latou's left? <clears throat> My department chief had a field day with that one. Even a blind person could see the shooter wasn't blind. Funny guy, huh? But that bloodstain helped uncover the biggest mystery of all. Now we know that Mr. Latou's was really with Interpol. We wouldn't have found that out without you. I suppose. Maybe that's why the chief gave me these after he was finished chewing me out. Ja. Dann solltest du dir definitiv mal eine andere Tastatur holen. Am besten mit eine mit Kabel. Said it was my reward. Are chocolate snackers popping out down at the precinct or something? I was hoping we could check out the crime scene again. Be my guest. You're not going to find any clues in here. Though I did find something strange. Something strange? Asked Mal the trial today. I met my embarrassment quarter for the year, that's for sure. Well, that's a good thing, isn't it? Um, how? Well, I mean, think about it. Now you don't have to be embarrassed about anything else all year. If only it worked that way. It just bugs me to think that little kid outsmarted me. And it makes him even more suspicious now that we know he can see. He could have seen the air duct and he could have shot that revolver. <laughs> But that's not how it sounded in Lamoureux's testimony. You mean her saying she heard Detective Darian's voice at the scene? Hmm. That's right. Why can't we have normal, straightforward killing once in a while in this country? I'll pretend I didn't hear that. <laughs> the case. Was that true what you said at court today? You know, about the case? About how everything was happening according to those song lyrics. Well, the guitar serenaded me. I found the link, you know. I found the link. First, Prosecutor Gavin's heart shaped key ring was stolen. Then, Le Mirois flew through the air. Then, Prosecutor Gavin's guitar caught on fire. And in the end, a bullet took Mr. Latouse's life. And he went up into the sky with the guitar. Well, 15 feet up at least. <laughs> Maybe a one day I'll be burying your children and then I'll just... <laughs> mein Güte. It is kind of hard to chalk it up to coincidence. Hmm. I know, and I found it. You think the same person did all of this? Don't ask me, I didn't do it. Neither did I. I couldn't fit through that air vent anyway. What? You all think I did it? Sometimes I worry about that girl. So what is the something strange thing you noticed? So what did you find? It's so little I must have passed over it yesterday. I found it under the sofa. What the fuck is that? What is it? Part of some device, I think. I haven't a clue what. <sighs> okay, hear me out. Is this a loudspeaker here? Or... Das könnte auch ein Böller sein. Also, was ich gerade sagen wollte. Was ist, wenn Letus schon früher getötet wurde? Und das Ding hat nur die Gunshot-Sounds gemacht. Na? Weil wenn wir jetzt mal sagen, Darian ist es gewesen, haben wir vorhin gesagt, das kann nicht sein, der hat ein Alibi, weil als die Schüsse gehört wurden, war der ja schon wieder am Spielen. Aber was, wenn der schon vorher angeschossen wurde und das Ding war nur dazu da, Gunshots äh, abzuspielen, während Darian auf der Bühne steht. 
Und es ist ja vor allem, hier steht nämlich auch im Autopsy Report, dass noch nicht klar ist, Time elapsed between shooting and death is currently under review. Also könnte es doch sein, dass der bereits angeschossen wurde, als diese Serenade spielte, weil da war Darian nicht dabei. Das war ja nur Machi, ähm, Klavier und, und die, die blinde Tante. Lamerois. Darian war da ja gar nicht äh, auf der Bühne. Und wenn Darian in dem Zeitraum ihn hier angeschossen hat und dann später während dem Konzert halt so eine Vorrichtung hatte, die Gunshots simuliert, hätte er halt ein super Alibi. Die Stimmen. Ja. Vielleicht hat das immer noch irgendwas hiermit zu tun. Oder die Stimmen kamen auch durch das Ding. Wenn das ein Lautsprecher ist, vielleicht hat das hier Peng Peng gemacht und das hier hat Stimmen abgespielt. Das sieht aus wie so ein Böller und das sieht aus wie ein Lautsprecher. Also Peng Peng und bla bla bla. Und dann wirkt das so, als hätten sich Leute in einem Raum gestritten und erschossen, obwohl der Mord, äh, der tödliche Schutz schon vorher stattgefunden hat. Weiß nicht, ich kann natürlich auch total daneben liegen. Das war jetzt nochmal so eine Idee, die ich gerade hatte, weil das ein bisschen wie ein Lautsprecher aussah. The bit sticking out from the end looked familiar, so I had it examined. Turns out it's an antenna. Oh, like on a beetle? Like on a cell phone. This device must use an electronic signal of some sort. Oh, da, das ist einfach nur das Ding, das äh, Klaviers Gitarre angezündet hat. Das könnte natürlich auch sein. Ja, yeah, das wollte ich vorhin gar nicht erwähnen, weil das meine Theorie direkt wieder ein bisschen bisschen wässrig macht, aber ja, dann hätte er ja wissen müssen, wann er ja mal als Zeuge ist. An electronic signal, you say. Hmm. Es sieht halt auch so ein bisschen aus wie irgendeine so Zündschnur, die abgebrannt ist. Also vielleicht war das auch das Ding, das in ähm, Klaviers Gitarre für Feuer gesorgt hat, wobei ich immer noch nicht weiß, was das eigentlich für einen Sinn haben sollte. Wir haben es jetzt im Chord Record? Ne, haben wir gar nicht. Können wir das bitte zum Chord Record hinzufügen? Ich finde, das ist schon irgendwie wichtig. Do you think you could take a look at this, Emma? Emma? Her rate of chewing is increasing. Better back off before it's too late. Do you think you could take a look at this? Instead of munching. Hmm, a small device. Looks like a transmitter. Transmitter? You press the switch here and it sends out a signal. I thought it could be off it. Hmm. This could naturally sein. Ich meine, wenn es das nicht ist, bin ich halt stehe ich echt auf dem Schlauch. Ich meine, was was für einen Sinn hat es, dass die Gitarre auf einmal anfängt zu brennen? Außer, dass es irgendwie die Leute ablenken soll. Aber eine Ablenkung ist ja dann eventuell dazu da, dass die Leute dahin gucken statt woanders. Aber die Leute haben ja eh schon dahin geguckt, weil die gerade ein Lied aufgeführt haben. Da brauchst du ja keine Ablenkung mehr. Gibt <lacht> aber keine Ablenkung mehr, die den Blick der Leute dahin lenkt, wo der Blick der Leute eh schon hingeht. No idea what it's for, though. The signal, you mean an electronic signal? What is it, Apollo? Say, Emma, you know that strange object you said you found? Oh, this? Let me try pressing this switch. Okay, this is the fire thing. Loot! It's on fire! Emma's device is on fire! I find the idea with loudspeaker was eigentlich auch ganz cool. What's the big idea? Uh. Well, now we know what this is an igniter. This part here must work like a lighter. <coughs> it nearly lit me up, that's for sure. Hey, don't look at me like that. I didn't do it on purpose. I suppose. At least we're getting somewhere with this case. Hey, Paolo. Let's ask Emma more about this switch. Now that she has some first-hand experience. <coughs> What are you trying to do? Burn me alive? 
Come on, it was just a few sparks. Says you, you were the one holding it. There's enough sparks flying around here just with you two talking. Anyway, now we know this is a remote for an igniter. Let me see that for a second. Well, well, this is definitely a little transmitter. The signal's weak, probably only reaches 30 feet. Oh, there's an elf. Uhr. <coughs> a transmitter, huh? <coughs> Remote trigger updated in the court record. Triggers an igniter within 30 feet. Okay, so we 30 feet. <coughs> Incidentally, if you look at a cross-section diagram of the stage area... <coughs> ich wollte jetzt gerade aufhören, aber jetzt interessiert mich noch eben, was sie da sagt. <coughs> oh. <coughs> Let's see. 30 feet from La Merois dressing room. That covers the backstage completely. It also looks like it would cover the stage. Hmm. Darian hat doch irgendwann seinen Gitarreneinsatz verpasst. Vielleicht hat er in dem Moment auf das Ding gedrückt, aber das kann ja nicht sein. Das war ja. Das war ja nicht während der Serenade. seems unlikely anyone would use this on stage. Forum diagram added to the court record. Cross-section diagram of the Sunshine Coliseum. Guess I'd best be getting on with my investigation. We're off to look for more clues elsewhere then. I feel better just knowing what this thing is now. I'll have to look into igniters a bit more later. Good luck. I'd like to know a bit more about igniters myself. Good. Till then, is this wohl der Zeitpunkt? wo ich speichere und wir nächste Woche Mittwoch weitermachen. Dann bin ich mal gespannt, ob wir den Fall dann lösen. Noch bin ich immer noch nicht so wirklich schlauer, was, wie das alles miteinander zusammenhängt. Aber ich bin mal gespannt, wie sich das auflösen wird. Dann mal gute Nacht und bis nächste Woche.